thinking about moving to Southwest Washington and you're wondering what top three areas are a lot of buyers gravitating to when they're looking to make the move. Well, you'll want to stay tuned because in this video, I'm going to tell you what those three areas are and why so many people are flocking to it. So let's get started right now. Hi, I'm Shastine and I am a local realtor here in Southwest Washington out today on this beautiful day in the hustle and bustle. And today's topic I am excited to talk about because there are a lot of buyers that when they're looking to relocate into any state, they obviously wanna know where are the key areas that a lot of people seem to be moving to? Well, in this video, I'm gonna talk about the three areas that a lot of buyers are moving into for a number of reasons. And for, so I'm gonna just go over each in every area, some things that you need to know about so that maybe by the time we're done with this video, you may have an idea whether one of these areas is an area for you. But thank you for watching and if you have questions or if you're relocating in, I would love to be able to help you. I am a local realtor, like I said, and so you can certainly call, text, or email. And so let's get started and let's find out what those three key areas are. you out in just one of the three communities that so many people are moving to here in Southwest Washington. And what area is that? That happens to be the area of Ridgefield, Washington. And in Ridgefield, Washington, which hit, which sits just north of Vancouver, Washington, around 22 minutes or so from downtown Vancouver, it is one of the number one areas that a lot of people are making the move to, both that live here locally, coming up further north into Ridgefield, and those who are relocating into Ridgefield. And why are they doing that? Well, for several reasons. First and foremost, as you can see around me, there is a lot of new construction going in, meaning a lot of communities. And what's nice about Ridgefield is the fact that you have not only the rolling hills, but you also have the vibrant growing suburban communities that are coming in. And did you know that according to Area Vibes, they're indicating that they got a 100% score for the friendliness of neighbors, and the, um, the sense of community in Ridgefield, along with having safety in the night hours and the pride of ownership. So that's pretty impressive. Another thing to know about Ridgefield is whether you like the old feel of a small town feel or an up and coming thriving uh, little city life, uh, still out north, so that's why I call it little city life. You're gonna get both here in Ridgefield because we have not only the old town of Ridgefield, but we actually have the new and upcoming town of Ridgefield. And so both vibrant little suburbs and beautiful rolling hills, which has a lot of the estate homes in it, it offers so much for everyone. Now, if you're looking, I always tell my clients all the time, if you're looking to purchase, and maybe it's going to be your move up home, you'll want to be able to purchase a home where you know that there's going to be future community growth, where you know that you're going to have the ability to be able to have growing equity in your home because communities are still going in, populations are still moving up, and Ridgefield is just that area. So that's why Ridgefield is one of the top three areas that a lot of my clients are moving to and that a lot of people are looking to gravitate to when they're living here in Southwest Washington. Whether you want to live in the newer part of Ridgefield or the older part of Ridgefield, the area has a place for you. But that may not be the only reason why so many people are looking to make the move here in Ridgefield, Washington. Uh, for one, Ridgefield, Washington has a number of wonderful parks and trails that you can enjoy all year round. My favorite here is Whipple Creek Park and of course, Ridgefield Wildlife Park. But some other things that you will want to know and enjoy regarding Ridgefield is the small town feel that it still has here in this area. And so whether you're looking to uh, be in the city or be away from the city in Southwest Washington, there is a place for you. 
As far as home prices go, the average sales price right now is around $601,000 with an average days on market of around 42 days. And if you were going to rent a property out in this area, it's going to be around $2,995 to rent a home. So that's kind of just a little sneak peek regarding what the housing prices and rentals are going for. Another reason why people are gravitating to Ridgefield, besides that old town charm or the new commercial that is coming in, is of course what I'm about to show you. And that is, you will begin to see right behind me, what a lot of people enjoy, which is fishing fishing and river life and Ridgefield offers just that. And let's not forget the beautiful sceneries that you will get to take in if you wanted to just take a nighttime stroll. at the second top area on our list that people gravitate to and that is the community of Valida. Unlike Ridgefield, Valida is a suburb of Vancouver, Washington and it sits on the west side of Vancouver. Valida offers the perfect blend of serene living and convenient access to everyday amenities, which might be one of the reasons why so many people choose to live here. Now, because it's on the west side, it's all about the easy access to important destinations. So you're gonna have easy access to all of your everyday conveniences within about a 15 minute drive from wherever you may be in Philida. Whether that's your stores, your medical facilities, shops, even getting to the I-5 bridge into Portland, Philida offers all the conveniences that will save a lot of people time, which is why they choose Valida here on the west side of Vancouver, Washington. With a population of 10,389 people, Valida is a thriving community that continues to grow at a rate of 5.5% annually. And this speaks to the desirability of the area and the potential for a vibrant and connected neighborhood. When it comes to schools, the quality of education here in Philida has earned a solid B plus niche rating, which is the second reason people move to this area. Families can take comfort in knowing that their children will receive a quality education within the community of Philida. Here is a hint as to another reason people choose Philida. Remember that river view that you saw in Ridgefield? Well, that same river, which is called Lake River, it will actually take you to one of the true gems of Philida, which is Vancouver Lake. Vancouver Lake is located southwest of Philida, and Vancouver Lake is a very large freshwater lake offering a range of recreational activities, as you can see behind me. Homeowners and visitors alike can enjoy swimming, boating, paddle boarding, and fishing. The lake, the lake is actually also surrounded by Vancouver Lake Regional Park, which is where I happen to be which features walking trails, picnic areas, and bird watching opportunities. So this is just one of the gems that people get to enjoy and I'll have a beautiful view of in Philida. Some things to know about the real estate here is that Philida's real estate market reflects the area's desirability. The medium home price in Philida is around 716,000, which is higher than 70% of the neighborhoods in Washington, according to the Neighborhood Scout. This indicates the value and the investment potential of the properties in this area. 
Additionally, a remarkable 90% of the residents in Philida own their own homes, just highlighting the community's stability and the pride of ownership. Now for those considering renting in Philida, it's important to note that the rate to rent a property here is currently around $3,277, which is one of the higher priced neighborhoods for renting. But again, it reflects the desirability of the area in general. The communities and the great roads and the lighting, and if the natural beauty was not enough for you to like this area, well then that will bring me to the final perk of living in Philida. You'll also have the pleasure of enjoying a leisurely stroll along the picturesque Salmon Creek trails. It's a five mile round trip paved trail that takes you through wetlands, around ponds, and across a natural habitat and only minutes away from Philida. Now you can watch my Salmon Creek vlog to see some of the beautiful drone and trail shots that I took. It's one of my regular go-to places that I love to go to take my walk. All of these are just some of the reasons why people choose Philida. So whether you're captivated by Philida's convenient location, the top rated schools, the enticing real estate market, or the stunning natural beauty that is all around you, Philida offers an exceptional living experience, which is why it made it in the top three areas that buyers are looking to purchase a home in. at our third and final stop that is in the top three areas that a lot of people look to make the move to when they make the move here in Southwest Washington. And what is that third area? It is Camas, Washington. Camas, Washington attracts individuals and families for a variety of reasons. And it's the high, it has to do with the high quality of life, the location, the natural beauty, and its high rated schools and its small town charm that make it such an appealing destination. Camas is the one area that you will find the most affluent homeowners within one small condensed area. With the average household income close to 147,000, people are choosing this area because of the location. It's located 15 miles east of Vancouver, Washington, and is close to the Portland International Airport, being only 13 miles away. And its population is still on the rise, being at just around 28,000. However, the lot sizes are shrinking as newer subdivisions go in because we only have so much land around and there happens to be only about six a little over 16 miles to be exact and that makes the affordability a little tougher being that the average sales price for a 2023 as of 2023 is 768 thousand dollars what you will find in Camas is a strong sense of community and a family friendly atmosphere. It has a small town charm, which offers a lot of local shops and restaurants, boutiques, and oh so much more. And yet it still has some newer areas coming uh, that are actually in the outskirts of Camas, Washington. So it has a little bit of everything for everyone. you have to stop off our little treat and my kryptonite happens to be chocolate and so let's go in and take a look at this cute little store called Sweet Intentions and maybe have a little chat with the owner. Hi I'm Lisa Pogue with Sweet Intention gift shop and we feature local artists. We've got over 40 artists here and we're in downtown Camas. We have a full chocolate shop up front. We do a lot of company gifts, a lot of branded things, closing gifts. Um, 10 jewelry artists, all kinds of things. So, um, come see us. The area 
offers a plethora of outdoor recreational activities, including hiking, biking, fishing, boating, and jogging. And it also has so many amazing parks and trails, like the one I'm in right now, called Heritage Lake Trail. And Grass Valley Trails, just to name a few, because there are a few, for sure. And of course, we can't forget to mention the stunning scenic views that you will get when you live in the hills of Camas. Now you know why so many people choose these three areas as a ideal location for them. Each one offers something very unique and special. As you can tell, there was a running th theme in all of them, which is every single location has wonderful walking trails and parks that they can have great memories, family time, use for exercise, relaxation. And that's one of the things you're gonna find in Southwest Washington is there are so many exterior activities that you can take part in and get out and enjoy all of the green scenery that we have here in our area. And so I'm ending my tour here at Heritage Trails and um, enjoying the scenery for sure. Um, if you're looking to make the move here in Southwest Washington, we'd love to help you. But until next time, I hope you have a great home buying and selling day. Sunflower